Bed Bath & Beyond, they missed earnings estimates last night. Now, earlier this week, you were excited about the busyness you saw in one of the stores. Yeah, you know, I guess that's anecdotal, right? I mean, yeah. I felt that best, I, what I've been saying about Bed Bath was it had a remarkable recovery from its previous quarter. Uh, in, the stock did, but there was no sign the, the company did. did. Right. The stock goes from 73 to 59, then comes back to 70. Uh, that is too much of a move, and now you're seeing the correction to the correction. Uh, this is a company that's going from 5% comp to 3.5. Got enough comp acceleration numbers like limited and recommended this morning. I cannot be in a decelerating comp situation. It's never paid off for me. They so I like the store, but it's not enough. They also had to pay for that comp with coupons. I know. Are they going to be able to get away from coupons? I mean, they, they are a big coupon company. Uh, JC Penney tried to get away. And, uh, I coupon when I'm at Bed Bath. And, mm -hmm. and uh, look, some the shelf life of this company may have run out for now. Um, I don't think it's been Amazon, but I just think it's got, you know, Target's come on strong, Walmart's come on strong. They've been making a series of acquisitions to try to make it so that things are better. And it's like, okay, well, you know, I don't want it right now. And that's how I feel. I don't want it. You don't want it. But what's the, what's the lag here? I mean, Home Depot's doing great. We're seeing numbers improving in the housing market. Well, Shouldn't Bed yeah, Bath & Beyond be improving? I agree. It should be. They've got some, uh, I love their stores, but the numbers are the numbers, Lindsay. And, you know, Home Depot's got a nice turn going on that fractionalwatchplus.com. I thought that maybe we should buy Bed Bath. Yeah. I talked about it with Stephanie Link, research director. But the more I dig, the more I just say, eh, there's others, there's better ones. Sometimes it's not a okay. severe judgment, it's just a judgment. This one has, it has something to prove now. Yeah, good point. This market has fewer players. We're in coming it. into a Monday where we're going to enter a new stage. It's a stock picker's market. Welcome to the five dumbest things. Apple reported earnings.